Anthony, well done. Always a good result to beat Ricky Walden. But how much pleasure do you take in the performance there? Yeah, no, it's uh, maybe even more pleasurable than the win. The, the win's more important, but I, I feel really good about myself when I play. I can play good snooker, and I did that in that match, pretty much from start to finish. Um, so yeah, it's probably maybe the best I've played here. It was a magnificent run to the semi-finals last year. It's not been your best season since I think it was four last 16 runs coming into this week. Has that been a bit of a disappointment? Did you expect to kick on a little bit more after last year? Yeah, definitely. Um, I've, I've not been getting the results that I think I, I think I should have been getting. Like my performances have definitely been better than my results, but that's way it goes. Sometimes you just got to sort of stay with it and be patient, and uh, hopefully it will turn. And uh, that, that was a cracking one because Ricky's, Ricky's quality, I rate him so highly. He's got everything. And uh, to beat him 10 5, I'm delighted. This is a place that, even before you run to the semi finals last year, always seems to bring out the best in you. What is it about the Crucible Theatre that sort of inspires your best form? Do you think? Just love it. You, know, you grew up watching it. And uh, even now, I'm like 30 years old, I'm a grown up man. And, but still, you kind of, there's a party, it just kind of still feels like a kid out there. Uh, and you just think it's just the best place ever. And uh, yeah, I just love it. It's, like I say, there's, there's not that many players worldwide get a chance to play there. I think the moms are people that play snooker. So, delighted to uh, just, I, I, I just love playing there. Yeah. That final frame against Kyron last year was obviously a crushing way to end what was a brilliant run. Does it make you even more determined to try and get back to that sort of one table setup and the really business stages here and, and, and taste that atmosphere again? Or? Yeah, definitely. I mean, now, going forward, each World Championship, from now on, my, sight, you know, my, my sights will be set on at least making the one table now that I've been there before. So that's what we're trying to do again this year and then yeah, see if I can achieve it. Yeah. A big uh, roadblock in your way in, in the next round to do that, Ronnie O'Sullivan, but it, I'm sure that's a, an occasion you'll relish. It's a sort of one of the main reasons, I suppose, these sorts of occasions that you pick up a key in the first place, isn't it? Yeah, of course. Uh, except playing, playing Ronnie at the, at the Crucible. Um, how can, you not be, how can you not be excited about that? So, um, yeah, hopefully I'll try and get a couple of days practice in and uh, I'll try my best in that match. A brilliant win today, Anthony. Well done. Betfred, proud sponsor of the World Snooker Championship.